During this session, we are going to focus on the abstract section of Divisions 3 through 6 of the AgriScience Fair Project Report. Using the National AgriScience Fair Handbook rubric, the abstract section should be a brief statement that describes the purpose, methods, results, and conclusions. Further, the abstract should not include cited references. The abstract is limited to one page. The abstract appears at the beginning of a research report but is generally written last. The purpose of the abstract is to tell the reader the general overview of the study. Looking at the example, let's break down the abstract. The underlying portion of the abstract addressed variables and key components of this study. Thus, this provides context and indicates a need for the research to be conducted. This is followed by the next sentence that clearly states the purpose of the study, highlighted in yellow. Highlighted in green, you'll see the methods utilized in the experiment, followed by the objectives. Explanations are not necessary in the abstract. Again, the author just needs to provide a concise overview of the key components. Following the methods are the key findings of the study based upon the methods. This is highlighted in gray. You'll notice that the green highlighting the method states that it's a two-group design, own rooted and grafted, and the results address both variables that are highlighted in the gray. Finally, highlighted in blue, you'll see the succinct conclusion. We added in a recommendation for future research. However, this is not required by the Science Fair Handbook rubric but it clearly shows the reader that the researchers have addressed future directions based on the results of this study.